Today I'm going to show you a piece of software that everybody needs to have in their PCs, and that is Revo Uninstaller. Because even if you use the Windows or the software on installer that comes with the program that you want to delete or remove from your system, it's always going to leave some things behind, like for example, some registry entries or some folders and files that you really don't need to have in your system. Now, there are three different versions. The Revo Uninstaller freeware that is completely free for use, the Revo Installer Pro, that you can have a free trial if you want to try it out, and you can purchase it for 24 bucks, and the Revo Installer Pro Portable. And if you want to purchase it after you try it with the free download in this video, is the one that I recommend because you can have it into a USB stick, you don't need to install it into any PC, and you can always use it with different systems. You don't need to have it into one PC, and then you need to purchase a new license. But for the sake of this video, we're going to be using the Revo Installer freeware. You want to click into free download. Once it's downloaded, you can open it itself from your web browser or you can open it from your downloads folder. The first thing that you want to need is to select your language, clicking OK. You need to check the mark to accept the terms of agreement of the license, clicking to next. And right here, you can change the destination folder if you want to set a different one, clicking to next. And now it's only if you want to create a desktop shortcut. Click into next. And install. When the setup wizard is done, you can already launch Review Installer. Click into finish. And here it's going to show you all the programs that you have right now installed into your system. As well, you can choose some Windows apps. It's going to give you all the Windows apps that you have in your system. And right here on the left side is some of the most important things that you can use. Like, for example, Auto Room Manager, Young Files Cleaner, Windows Tools, and something more. Once you open, for example, the Young Files Cleaner, you want to click into Scan. And you need to wait, depending on how many drives you have and how big they are. And as you can see right here, I have a bunch of items that they aren't used, that is junk, like it says itself. And right now I can clean and delete all of them. You can select every one of them and click to delete. What I say already before is that sometimes when you delete one software, you can have the problem that is going to let some things behind. So select, for example, this Anvil Studio 64-bit and you want to click into uninstall on the top bar. Now you can check this mark to make a system restore point before you install if you need it. If it's an important software, I don't need it right now, so I'm not going to select it and click into continue. Now I'm going to select into remove and finish. Now this is completely removed, close. And now you can, with Revo Uninstaller, scan to see if this lit anything into your registry or some folders. And as you can see, this leave some things in the registry that you don't really need it. This is going to slow down your computer. So what you want to do right now is to select the keys that you don't need, that they are from the Anvil Studio, and you want to click into delete. Yes, now you're not going to have it. And these are the leftover files and folders that again, you don't need to have them in your system. So select all and click into delete. Now you completely uninstall that software finally from your PC. It's not going to slow it down or to generate any problems for the future. And guys, that is pretty much it for this video. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the channel for more tech tutorials, guides, unboxings, and anything else. Thanks for watching, my friends, and like always, see you guys on the next time. Bye-bye.